It's a beautiful day here in New York City. Right now I'm at Hoyt Playground in my home neighborhood of Astoria, Queens. I unfortunately have a lot of work to get done this week, but I'm still gonna eat well. That's the nice thing when one's passion is food. No matter how busy you are, you still gotta eat. So for lunch today, I'm going to a real classic New York City neighborhood institution, Sal, Chris, and Charlie's Deli. It's an old school deli and sandwich shop, and on their menu is a sandwich called The Bomb, which looks absolutely epic and is something that I need in my life. The establishment is in the Dittmars area of Astoria, so without any further delay, let's go to lunch. Located just a couple of blocks from the Astoria Dittmars station is Sal, Chris, and Charlie's Deli. The family-owned eatery has been operating for decades and remains a popular neighborhood spot for lunch. I was lucky when I arrived. There were only two people ahead of me, but it wasn't long before there were about 10 people behind me. There's a good selection of sandwiches, but I knew what I wanted, the bomb, fully loaded, of course. It's important to note that the deli is cash only, but for what they offer, it's incredibly affordable and it shouldn't be a problem. All of the sandwiches I saw being prepared were pretty sizable, but I was blown away when I saw mine. Believe me, there's no photo or video that can do this sandwich justice. It's so much bigger in person. Just got my sandwich. This is so damn big. This is so heavy. Wow. All right, time to head to the park and eat this massive monster here. Back at the park, let's dig in. This is just so ridiculous. This is massive. Just look how big this is. This is food for giant people. Look how it compares to my face. This is ridiculous. But at the same time, this sandwich is ridiculously good looking. Wow. Jeez, look at all that stuff on there. There's like, there's a hell of a lot of ingredients on this sandwich, that's for sure. In essence, the bomb is a combination of Italian and American flavors. There's a mix of Italian cold cuts like salami, prosciutto, pepperoni, mortadella, soppressata, and capicola. Then there's a series of American meats like turkey, roast beef, ham, and pastrami. In addition, both American and provolone cheese are on the sandwich along with lettuce, onions, tomatoes, hot peppers, and sweet peppers. Finally, there's mayonnaise and mustard and probably some other stuff too. Basically, an entire deli has been thrown onto a sandwich. So this is half. Actually, it's a little smaller than half. It's like 40%, it wasn't an even cut, but this is so big. This could easily satisfy a person's craving. This is massive, and I'm so happy about it. I did not get any chips. I thought I'd have a, a light lunch. Yeah, right. Mmm. That's a hell of a lot of stuff, wow. So many flavors going on, but all good ones. This is a good sandwich, that's for sure. This is really good. I mean, it's so big, I can't even get my mouth around the whole thing. It's just, it's on another scale entirely, but it is really good. It was just so tall and wide that my jaw couldn't mm. extend enough to consume both the top and bottom pieces of bread in one bite. But I'm not complaining because those are some good bites that came at a very affordable price. For an Italian deli slash grinder slash hero sandwich, there is literally everything you could want on here. It is so awesome. This is a hell of a sandwich. I mean, there's like every kind of meat you could possibly imagine on here. It is, it's loaded, that's for sure. While there's no shortage of meat on the sandwich, it's nicely balanced as there's a decent amount of sweetness and spice from the peppers, which really helps cut through some of the heavier flavors from the meat. Plus there's that sweetness from the tomato, which really helps the whole sandwich. And plus with all those vegetables on there, yeah, you know, it kind of feels a little healthy. Not really though, but it's good. I also enjoyed the pleasant and bitter taste of the mustard, which lent another satisfying flavor profile. While it may seem as though everything was added haphazardly to the sandwich, flavor-wise, it works. Even though I may not be able to recognize the flavors of some of the more subtle ingredients like the turkey when it has to compete with all those other toppings, the end result is still a delicious sub. Kind of messy too. Luckily, they gave me a lot of napkins, and I'll be using those for sure. Of course, one of the most important elements of any sandwich is its bread, and the bomb's bread is just right. It's nice, fresh, and tasty, but it's still robust enough to hold all the numerous ingredients of the sandwich together without sagging under the sheer weight of it all. 
There's no doubt about it, the bomb is a noteworthy sandwich. It's the epitome of what makes a New York City deli like Sal, Chris, and Charlie's a special place. Well, I finished half. Now, I am confident I can finish the other half of this sandwich, but I'm satisfied right now. There really isn't much of a point. And besides, that other half of the sandwich is gonna make a pretty nice dinner. I think that's also one of the main appeals of the sandwich. While it is epic looking and absolutely delicious, you get a lot for your money. I believe the deli opens up pretty early. One can go there in the morning, get the sandwich for breakfast, eat a little, save some for lunch, then save the rest for dinner. You literally have an entire day's worth of food. To live in New York City, the most expensive place on earth, and to have an option like the bomb sandwich from Sal, Chris, and Charlie's Deli is simply so refreshing when it seems like everything is just getting more and more expensive. Clearly, one gets their money's worth, but most importantly, it's a delicious, epic sandwich. Sal, Chris, and Charlie's Deli is an Astoria and New York City institution. It is a phenomenal place. They serve amazing sandwiches. The bomb was absolutely epic. I can't wait to return to the establishment, and I can't wait to finish my sandwich for dinner tonight.